Namaskar students students in this video i am going to continue chapter number 3 that is more on microsoft word in this video we are going to learn what are header and footer what are footnote and endnote so let us continue header and footer are the areas on the top and bottom margin of each page in a document you can insert text number or graphics in header and footer For example you can insert page numbers date a company's logo document's title or a file name in the header and footer area so now what is a header can you see over here this is the document area right here when i am clicking the cursor is blinking over here can you see this one here it is given type the document title this is area is known as the header area over here you can write anything Okay, when I am double clicking over here, see my header area is now active. My header area is now active. I can remove this and I can write my own heading. Now, how I have bring this header in my document? Let me show you. How to insert an header? To insert an header, see, click on the Insert tab. From there, click on this header option. Now see, can you see this alphabet type the document? This one option I have choose for that cause it is appearing over here. So I have to choose alphabet. Now see, type the document title. Okay, it is appearing like this. Now you have to delete this type the document title by pressing the backspace and now write your own heading. You can write any heading. You can also give a page number. You can give the logo. You can insert a graphics in the in this header area as well. So now let me give the heading. I am giving as a heading as robots. I can also increase the size. See, make it as bold, or you can give it any other. handwriting also okay so this had gone about robot now see when i am uh, writing the robot over here in the header area this article is of two page can you see the robot heading is appearing in the second page as well if you are writing the article on the same article you are writing then it's not a problem you can give the same heading but if you want to give the different heading then what you can do you have to click different first page okay or different odd and even pages odd and even pages one means what the page number 1 3 5 that means the odd pages will have a same heading even pages will have a same heading so you can click on different first page when you click on the different first page what is happening again it will ask you for the any other heading for the first page the heading is being applied in the second page that is being kept as it is now it will ask for the different heading for the first page okay so you can give a different heading or you can keep it as it is you can keep it as it is as i am writing the article on the robot only i can keep it as it is but what will happen is that the header will be shown in the next page the same header will be shown in the next or even in the another page also So this had gone about the header. After completing it, click on close header and footer, or you can double click in the middle of this document. See, when I double click in the middle of this document, or you can click on that close header and footer, my cursor is now blinking in the document area, and the header portion is now deactivated. Okay, it is not activated. My cursor, my my document area is now active area. So this had gone about the heading. now let us give the footer let us give the footer how to insert a footer again go to the insert from there click on the footer you can also click on this alphabet see type text page 1 if you go to the second page type text page 2 see automatically the page number is now changing in this child the automatically the page number is changing now over here in the type text you can uh, give any reference like you can write a reference you are writing it over here articles on robot okay now double click in the middle my document area is now active footer area is now deactivated okay is over here see articles on robot and page 1 it is given 
same way articles on Rovo, the same text is appearing in all the pages and it is appearing page 2. So this way what is happening in the footer area, what is happening is that you can insert the graphics, you can insert the text, page number, anything you can insert. So this is the way we can insert the header and footer in the document area. Now let us see how to insert the end note and the footnote. What is a footnote and end note? Footnote and end note are inserted in a document to explain, comment or provide references for the text in a document. Footnote is placed at the end of the page in a document an end node is placed at the end of the whole document. That means footnote you can place it at the end of this page. Different footnote you can place. This is the first page. If you want to insert, if you want to write anything, you can write using the footnote. But if you don't want to insert particular node in all the pages, but you want to insert node at the end of the document, that means this is the end of the document. If you want to write anything, if you want to give the reference, from where you have got this article that also you can write at the end of this document by using end note okay so this is the difference between the footnote and end note end note you will be writing at the end of the document footnote is placed at the end of the page in a document so let us see how to insert the footnote what do you have to go you have to go to the references from there select the insert note when I click on the insert footnote, what is happening? See, it is appearing at the end of the page. Okay, this is the end of the first page. As this is the end of the first page, it is appearing over here. You can write anything, any anything you can write. I am writing simply. I am writing a simple text. You can write anything. You can give any reference also. Okay, you can give a reference of the picture. You can give a link of a picture of any robotic picture. Anything, any link can be also inserted over here. So after writing, see, my footnote is now over. So this had gone about the first footnote that is article on footnote. Can you see? It is appearing over here only. Is it appearing in the second page as well? No. So, in this way, what is happening? The footnote, what is it is? The footnote is inserted at the end of the page in a document. Now, if you want to insert the end note, what you will do? You will click on the insert end note. See, it went at the end of this document. It is not appearing in the first page, but it is going in the second page as the second page is the end of the document. It will go to the end of the document. Now, what I can do is that I can insert the I can copy this link from where I got, where from where I have written the article. Select it from the keyboard, press Ctrl plus C or from here right click and copy. Okay. And from here now again go to the word, click over here and press the Ctrl plus V. That is a shortcut for the paste option. Ctrl plus V and see it is being inserted the link is being inserted so this is the way what is happening i am giving a reference to my document by placing it at the end of the document so this is the end note and this is the footnote so now i think it is now clear to you what is the footnote and what is the end note so in this way, we can give the footnote, we can give the end note. It will be helpful for the references to see the references. When I am giving a link over here, I can click it over here. When I am pressing a control, see, I am pressing a control from the keyboard and my cursor is changing to a handset. When I, I will click on this link, my um, Google Chrome will take me to that linked article. Okay. So this is the end of the document. With this, we have completed the header, footer and the end note and the footnote. Thank you. Namaste.